Hello YouTube. This is the attraction tag created by Kobe. Um, if you don't follow him, you should. It's really cool. The reason that I was attracted to the attraction tag was because it covered so many details about attraction that people don't really think of and even when he was going through it, I was thinking about some of the different things of the attraction tag and I thought it was really, really interesting to look at attraction in so many different ways, especially as someone who you will find out is asexual. So let's get started. In terms of romantic attraction, what genders, if any, are you attracted to? Romantically, I am mostly just attracted to males, some non-binary people. In terms of sexual attraction, what genders, if any, are you attracted to? None. I have never looked at somebody and been like, oh, I want to have sex with them. That has never been a thought, so. Nobody. Not sexually attracted to anyone. In terms of aesthetic attraction, what genders, if any, are you attracted to? Aesthetically, like, people that I could just stare at and admire? Basically, any genders. If somebody's really pretty, I'm just gonna be like, you're pretty. I like looking at you. And that's just how it works for me. In terms of emotional attraction, what genders, if any, are you attracted to? Emotionally? I am attracted to any genders. If I can make a good bond with them, then emotionally I'll be pretty attracted to them. Do you get crushes on people? What genders, if any? I get crushes on guys. Do you want to date and or be in some kind of exclusive relationship with someone? What genders, if any? I want to date guys, maybe non-binary people. Do you want to spend the rest of your life with someone? What genders, if any? I prefer guys if it's just like spending the rest of my life with someone, like a life buddy. I could do anyone, like that's, the gender doesn't matter there as long as we're committed to each other and I think it has a similar appeal to me as the like emotional attraction because that's what would matter to me in like a long term relationship. Do you want children? Do you want to conceive them? with a partner. I would love to have children and I would love to not conceive them. So I will be adopting. Um, as far as with a partner, yeah, I would love to have children with someone that I love and care about as well and that we can like love the children together. That'd be cool. Do you feel comfortable with holding hands? What genders, if any? I am comfortable with holding hands with anyone. Platonically, romantically, holding hands is chill. Do you feel comfortable with cuddling? What genders, if any? Again, I am fine with cuddling. Obviously, at that point, I want like an emotional co connection. Like, if I'm holding hands with someone, like for a game or an activity or something, like, does not matter. Cuddling, I want an emotional attraction. Do you feel comfortable with kissing or making out? What genders, if any? I am not comfortable with kissing or making out, so no one. <laughs> Do you feel comfortable with going all the way? What genders, if any? No. <laughs> no genders. Nobody. Is romance important to you in a relationship? Pretty important. I mean, it doesn't have to be like the big thing. We don't have to be super romantic or anything like that but a little bit here and there, you know? Just the, like, cute, caring about you, thinking about you type of things. Is sex important to you in a relationship? No. <laughs> Out of everything, what is most important to you in a relationship? Communication is definitely going to be the most important in a relationship. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any more questions or clarifications, feel free to ask questions in the comments below. See you soon. Bye.